Three years ago today, on August 27th, 2013, Origins came out for Black Ops 2 Zombies first on Xbox 360. Guys, within three years we have had so many good maps and so much fun on Zombies, and it's honestly kind of sad to say that this storyline of Origins will be coming to an end with Revelations in the next 10 days. It's really crazy guys, honestly. I mean, we have the original storyline with the World War II characters, and that ended in Buried, basically, when we either help Maxis or help Richtofen, and the storyline will reset and then take us back into Origins. So basically, guys, the first storyline was closed out, a new one had opened, but now I think that this is coming to an end where this storyline will be forever closed off and done. It's actually quite bittersweet, guys, to know that the zombie storyline that we all kind of grew up on when zombies wasn't even popular, when Mark Lamia signed off on a bonus mode, which was Nocturne Totem for World of War, which he honestly thought, you know, could have sunk the game um, if it didn't go over well, or, you know, the people at Activision really didn't have any faith in the idea. Um, this is before, you know, every single game now is made out of zombies, you know, Infinity Ward's doing it, um, you know, there's a lot more zombie games on the market now, a lot of that good stuff, but this was kind of like the, the beginning of when zombies was just kind of a, a different thing in the game, and we followed those characters for eight long years, and I think now it's coming to an end, and even though it's a very bittersweet moment, I'm very excited to see what Treyarch will do next with the storyline, but I think that they're actually closing out an era of a good zombie game with Revelations DLC. Now, there's nothing wrong against that, guys. The storyline does need to come to an end eventually, but what will happen in the future without these characters in our games, and how will zombies adapt to a new storyline that we kind of have grown to know and love? Regardless, I think Treyarch has done a fantastic job with everything that they have done, from the lighting effects, to the songs, to the Easter eggs, to the actual storyline itself. Um, you know, Mark Lamia, Jason Blundell, Kevin Sherwood, uh, he's follows me on Twitter, but you know everyone guys at Treyarch has done a fantastic job and they need to be recognized for this. Obviously everyone already loves them enough, but um, it's just kind of a thing that we need to show them the support um, and the love of the game and hopefully a new storyline will come with the next Call of Duty game. With that being said guys, I'm moving to college in about the next two hours. Thank you all for watching. My name is Ryan and I'll catch you in the next one.